I don't know if there's one more left or if this is it. But, I wanted to thank you. I cannot believe it's been this fucking long. It's just 27 hours. Good God. Thank you for hanging out, watching, and having fun. I, I've been. Yuki time. I don't know if there's one more on the other... Or if this is the last chapter. I, I, no, I, I guess if we get two trophies in this, we'll know. Oh, Yuki's a platform. Okay, we're on a train station. Hinashiro. Or Hinashiro. One of those. <laughs> One of those two. 2017, December 4th, 7.06 a.m. Hinashiro Station. Huh? What the fuck? So my fucking train glitch, motherfucker! <laughs> Don't you like she's crazy with rage? Huh? I gotta get that back. Oh my god. I, I just face palm so hard right now. Don't tell oh fuck, I gotta get hang on, I gotta get something. <laughs> My controller's about to die. I gotta get a backup controller near me. Who could have foreseen that? Stupid bitch. Please don't do what she did. If, if you drop it, let it go. It's not worth your life. <laughs> I gotta get that back. <laughs> oh my god. Huh? At home. Who's home? So we're not Tokyo anymore. Seven nineteen train delay. Accident resulting in injury or death. Time of occurrence seven oh six. Oh, not again! Another person hit by a train. Didn't this happen last month too? It must be that time of month. Ah uh, ah uh, ah! Uh. <laughs> yeah. So the trains are stopped. Yeah. I'll get a note for school from the station master. Good idea. Why are these kids? Oh my god, I got a smartphone now. <laughs> can chat, I can delay information. Oh, okay, the Chuo main line is delayed between Hinoshiro and Tsutsumushita stations due to the accident that occurred at 706 at Hinoshiro Station. Oh, back at you, bitch. <laughs> you on your way to school? Fuck you, Yuki. Yup. Oh, Rena. Her name is Rena. Another suicide at Hinashiro Street. Station. Seriously? Was it her? Definitely her. Zombie chick from Monday. Yeah, same as two weeks ago. When was it the zombie chick first talked to you? Morning of the last Monday in October. That's a fucking... Alright, hang on. <laughs> yeah, hang on a second. Oh, being sick sucks ass. Morning of the last Monday in October. It was just weirdly worded. It's been that long? What did she say to you again? You can see me, can't you? Lol. Scary. Did you respond? Hell no, lol. Best to ignore it, lol. So I just keep ignoring her. Yeah, huh. But she's hella annoying. There's all kinds of people out there, but she's super annoying. She loves you, lol. What if she, like, attacks you, or rapes you? <laughs> she hasn't yet. Just talks to me. Like she can't touch me. Like she tries to touch you and just passes through, lol? What? I don't know. 
What's the zombie chick look like? Like a zombie. Normal clothes. Super black hair. Didn't she cause the accident? Probably. She probably killed someone. Can't they do something about it? Nope. That sucks. Not like anyone is going to make her leave you alone too. Seriously? What an emo weirdo. Hella annoying. God damn it. I, do I really have to read little shitheads talking all damn night the rest of the game? Looks like it. I don't need to read the delay information again. I guess I do. Oh, the service resumed. The Chuo mainline operation expected to resume at 810. Then you get there's like, ha ha ha, we didn't say what day, ha ha ha, <laughs> 837. God damn, that sneeze fucked my throat up. Yeah, it's one of those that sneezed so hard, like everything, that was fucking weird. That kid looks evil as fuck. Operation resumed. Chuo mainline resumed, operation at 830, blah blah, assuming AM. Additional delays may occur. There's the zombie, I guess. Here she comes. Huh? Her hair. Half of it's gone. What? Hey! I don't know if you can hear this panting or weird shit that they've got going. It's weird. What the hell? Huh? I gotta get that. <laughs> she just gets everybody to do the same thing over and over. Are you fucking kidding me? It's because people pay a thousand dollars for the goddamn smartphones. They're like, it's worth it. You got legs, right? Use those legs and run the hell away. Four fifteen PM classroom. I lost my phone. This sucks. And that person just What the fuck else can I do? Oh, I can move now. I should find my phone. If I had a PC, I could track its location. I just guessed. I had no idea. I was like, I'm thinking over here because there's a bright green light over here. Computer room. Ooh. Please log in. She's saying that to herself. Hello, Yuki Kazura. Looking for your lost phone? All you need to do is answer this quiz correctly. Huh? A quiz? Question one. What do the moon and the turtle have in common? They wax and wane. They wax and wane. Oh, fuck off. Oh, motherfucker. What do the moon and the turtle have in common? I guess they're both round. Which phrase implies that even a master can make a mistake? Even Homer sometimes nods, even Mo sometimes nods, even Barney sometimes nods. Are you fucking serious? Uh, I don't know if I'm thinking of The Simpsons, what the fuck? God damn it! This is such a hassle! 
They always make this shit stupid. It's always questions you don't even fucking remember. What's your favorite food? I don't know, when I was five it was macaroni and cheese. It changes all the time, you dickheads. Try Homer. Is it all the first answer? Who said freedom is the recognition of necessity? Marx. Oh, you fuckers, it's not all the first one. I don't know any of this shit. And we know they're all the first ones. We've heard this name in jails. Question four. Which phrase means the opposite of a soft answer? Is a specific cure of anger. Which phrase means the opposite of a soft answer is a specific cure of anger? Tit for tat. Who said the torch has been passed on to a new generation? Jesus. Kennedy? Okay. The phone is in a coin locker at Hinoshiro Station, west entrance. Key is in the shoebox. What? This is crazy. She still goes anyways. Where the hell am I going? What? I'm going upstairs. Or downstairs. I'm assuming we're leaving school. Oh, it's in the shoebox here. We're at the station. Okay, I thought we were at school. My shoebox? What the fuck? I don't I don't know what the fuck you're talking about. What number? My shoebox. That what the fuck? This is like seven four. The only other thing I have is item. Yeah. Try 7-4. I have no fucking idea. It's not like I can move either. I'm, I'm fucking stuck here. I don't get it. I have no idea what the fuck. I'm gonna end this video and watch it and see if I can figure it out. God damn it. I'm hoping that it gave me a number somewhere and I missed it. Hang on. I'll bring I'll bring you right back. As my last try, it says attendance number 11. I doubt that's it, but it's the only fucking number I see. Fuck yeah, cool. Alright, I figured that out. Holy shit. Now I feel like I'm playing fucking Yakuza. Acquire, acquired coin locker key. Huh? 5 p.m. in the Hinoshiro station? Nobody's here apparently. Thank you. 
Alright, go to the platform. Don't throw your phone down there this time. Coin locker. What the fuck would this be? God damn it! Nope, she doesn't even talk to herself. She's like, oh, it's gotta be this. No, she doesn't even do that. Alright, 026, I guess, is it. Yep. Sweet! Now I got her phone. Here it is! Piece of shit and just throws it back out there. I gotta get that. <laughs> that zombie chick is seriously fucked up. So at the very least, you should probably walk on to the next stop on Mondays. That would be safer, and it would be good for your health, too. You're just gonna have to leave it alone until it blows over. Hey, you seeing this? Seriously, what the hell? Slash. We're gonna block him. Ah. Get fucked, Slash. Strike again coffee? What? Don't know if I like that name for my coffee. Looks like a quaint shop though, like a nice chill place. Oh, I thought it said SNES. <laughs> Oh my god, I totally felt the impact. Never been on a train where there was a jumper before. -y! Good morning, there was an accident at Hinoshira Station. It was pretty hardcore. I saw a cop puke. The train I'm on hit someone. I can still hear the screech sound from below. It feels like I'm gonna be cursed. Damn! On the platform, I saw someone get hit by the train. Now the trains are stopped. Helicopter cars at Hinoshiro Station. Ambulances too. Too scary. I want to go home. Mewtwo. Really? Mewtwo 2001. Deaconote. Announcement says they don't know when the trains will run again. The station guy sounds pissed. There's some messed up shit on the tracks. I can hear the conversation. So nasty. Hinoshiro Station. For reals? How many more times is this going to happen? So many accidents this year. Hinoshiro Station is like a full on suicide, su suicide spot now. This is the fifth accident since the last summer, and all of them have been women. The woman who got hit today didn't really jump, it was more like she calmly walked off onto the tracks. Do you mind? Excuse me? All the other seats are filled. Do you mind if I sit here? Go ahead. Dark chocolate chip matcha cream frappuccino with extra whipped cream. What? We've got the same drink. I love this. But did you know it's got loads of calories? Is this how this guy hits on a girl? Am I a girl? I've made that mistake in this game before. I think that's a girl. Yeah, I know, but what do you want? Oh, it's just... That accident at Hinoshiro Station this morning? Or rather, this string of serial killings? I've been looking into them. Huh? So are they accidents? Or murders or, or what? Officially they're accidents. But they're actually murders. Don't you think so? Why are you asking me? Well... I should have introduced myself sooner, but I'm actually a freelance reporter. My name is Hiragi. I'm covering a bunch of different angles. And right now I'm gathering info. 
I... I don't know anything about this. But just now you were reading about the accident on social media, right? Are you spying on me or something? I just happened to catch a glimpse. Would you mind just giving me your opinion on these incidents, please? I take that train to school, so it's just a hassle. These accidents only occur on Mondays, did you know that? And only between 6 and 10. Does that mean something? Yes. I found that the first incident happened three years ago. And it occurred at 7.35 on a Monday. A 26-year-old female officer worker, office worker died. That's enough. I don't really want to hear about it. I can see it. You know. See what? The woman on the platform at Hinoshiro Station. I'm pretty sure she only appears on Monday mornings. I mean, what I can see is like... Something like a residual image. I can't really see it clearly and sometimes I lose sight of it. But I did see it, a woman on the platform. Her face looked like it was all decayed and messed up, you know? So you've been able to see her? For a long time? Yeah. I've been seeing her for a while now. I actually make a living as a freelance journalist, but I also have side work as well. I almost never receive money for it, so I guess it's sort of like a volunteer type thing. As I say, it's not your job then. What kind of side work? I'm an exorcist. A freelance journalist exorcist. Put simply, I extract and dispel malicious paranormal en energy. This is generally called exorcism. I perform exorcisms using ancient traditional methods. I purified all sorts of places. We're now in the year 2017. Alright, I'm gonna go check something real quick. Probably about time for me to upload that video, so it'd probably clear at about 9 o'clock. God damn, it's late. Eh, hopefully you get it. You, you probably won't be even expecting this one. <laughs> You probably won't be expecting me to go right into the next one and finishing this up, but that's what I'm trying to do. I said I wanted to keep my word, not even because I'm like obsessed with keeping my. I just like to be that kind of character, that kind of person. I want to be remembered for keeping my word and doing what I say. And yeah, it might be to my detriment because I'm sick, but that just happened. You know, it has nothing to do with you. If I give my word, I try to keep my word. So, all right, I'll be right back. All right, just in case you don't know better. There's a Sega Genesis collection that just came out. Stay away from it. It's a piece of crap. I was wondering why they don't fucking name all the games in it. Because on, on the, the digital store, I'm like looking it up. I'm like, huh? What games are in it? They, they cut out games. They don't even have Echo. They don't even have Vector Man. It's like, what the fuck? And apparently they run like shit. They're not colored right. They don't size. They're not stretched properly. It, it's all fucked up. I just wanted to give you a heads up on that. I'm actually interested in this. I don't really like this girl. I don't know what the zombies about, so we're gonna check it out. We're now in the year 2017. It's weird to say. But even today, there are still places all over the city that are plagued with spirits, which have somehow remained and continued to exist. You look like a spirit, like you look like you've been dead for a long time, dude. If they're benign and they, they don't really affect you, you can usually just leave them alone. But there are some like the woman at Hinoshiro Station, which actively seek to hurt people. Somebody needs to take care of spirits like these. That is what I call purification. It's close enough. It's close enough to what it said. Shut up. I exercise and dispel the malicious energy, and then return the location to its original state through purification. Was my explanation too rambling? Yes. Why are you telling me this? Because I've been watching you, of course. <laughs> Listen. I've realized that you're far more aware of that than I am. Am I wrong? Who knows? Anyway. 
I understand how you feel. I've actually exercised that woman once before, so you're not very good at this job. You, you shouldn't have exercised her before because she's still there, so you never did exercise her, you jackass. However, she still retains some of her power. The power to remain at that place. Another exorcism and purification will be necessary. But that woman is strong. Or rather, more than the woman herself being strong, it may be that the location itself is just that sort of place. It's possible that long ago something similar happened there, and the residual energy has remained and built up over time. Anyway, what I'm trying to get at is, god damn, that, that was hot and really stupid. Should have waited for that to cool off. What I'm trying to get at is, I'd like you to help me. Huh? You mean do the exorcism? Fuck you. I'll do that myself, bitch. <laughs> but I'm not really able to see her properly, so I want you to act as my eyes. I'd like you to accompany me and tell me what's happening. What's happening, D? <laughs> I don't... I don't think I can. As of this morning, you and I had never met nor spoken. So at the, t at the time... All I could do to help you was push the woman away and spur the moment. What the fuck are you talking about? Really? I don't understand this conversation at all. But now we know each other. Oh my god. So please, act as my eyes. And I'll act as the arms and legs. We should work together. We'd make a good team. Team? Yes, team. This is fucking weird. I feel like he's like a fucking pedophile or something. Hope this is legit and it's not like set up for a pedophile. December 11, 7.44 a.m. Hinashiro Station. Huh? Pagori. It's Pagori drinks. Thanks for giving me so many options. You can tell we're near the end of the game. Like, eh, fuck you. You're not. You don't even get other options anymore. God, stop playing on your goddamn phone. Oh, you make it there? Yup. Uh, you okay? I don't know. You getting all excited? L like a real haunted house? Ha 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 ha! Oh my God, shut up. If it gets bad, then get out of there, okay? What a dickhead. Are you shitting me? You made it fucking three steps! Hey, hey, hey! Oh, it's Slash. I thought you blocked him. This situation is seriously fucked. You really need to stop this. Also, what the fuck? You're reading these, so reply. Is the Frappuccino guy there? Nope. It's almost time. He might be on the platform. But also, I got a message from that weirdo. The stalker who found your phone? Yeah, I blocked him, but I still get messages. What the fuck? He must be a hacker. Hacker, lol. Yeah, I can't even... Okay. Oh my god! This is real life! You kids these days just don't listen. <laughs> anyway, if you feel at all in danger, just get the fuck out of there immediately. Oh, I thought you were going to do it again. Wow. Hey, you came. Phrasing boom. This is like a doctor's behind you. Alrighty then. Behind you. Huh? I see her. Once she's visible, I've got her. See? You have to get a hold of part of her body. The hair is easiest. Rubbing her like this begins the exorcism. Uh, are we watching necrophilia? Her pain and hatred, hatred have deepened. She's gonna fight back. Get the fuck out of there!
What? Where? Over here. Am I a midget or am I crawling? Why? It seems like I was way too low on that. I guess I am a little kid. Jesus Christ, how small am I? Are you that stalker called Slash? Oh no. Slash is an old friend. My name is Tokyo Morishima. Okay then. What about the guy named Haragi with the Frappuccino? He's basically just a little shit fuck ass punk motherfucker. He knows what's going on to a certain extent, but he's making things worse with the way he tries to handle the situation and getting in my goddamn way. What's going on? That thing on the platform. Uh, 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 uh. This fucking music. She simply convinced herself that she isn't dead. She wanted to die, but she believes that she wasn't able to. So she tries to kill herself again and again. But without a physical body, she can't get hit by the train. So she tries to sync up with other women around her age and get them to get down onto the tracks. Poor woman. Really? She's just broken. And broken in a way that's harmful to others. And don't fucking now, and now I got that goddamn Amy Lee song stuck in my head. Fuck you, game. See, there, son of a bitch. Isn't there something that can be done? You just gotta leave her alone. That or somehow make her understand that she's already dead. The only way to do that would be to take her in and face off against her. I thought it said to take her face off for a second. And are you able to do that? I was able to before, but not now. No, now I'm just a Walmart do door greeter. I might be able to now too. What the fuck? I was before, but I might be able to now too. What a dickhead. Then why don't you do it? Because I'm scared of Rosh Buff. Because it's really difficult. It's also a real hassle. Can you see her too? I can't see her myself. I can only feel her. Can you see her? Yeah. I can see her and... And? And when she grabbed my arm I felt it. Then you're more powerful than me. So they're both mediums, okay. Well we knew Tokyo was. She's way more powerful, huh? I don't want that kind of power. Yeah, well. Get fucked. Okay, I'm going. The train's still moving. Um. Yeah. Don't you have, like, any advice for me or anything? I'm not really in any position to be giving you advice. But steer clear of that platform. Even on other days of the week. That's about it. So confused. Huh? God damn it, all I can do is chat. Ah, oh, this fucking thing again. So what exactly was it that Frappuccino wanted to do anyways? Like he tried to take out a monster and end up leveling it up or something. So he was just some weak ass loser after all. I've been thinking. What? I've been thinking this since I was little. Maybe it's not that they've always been there and I've been able to see them. But maybe they're there because I'm here, you know? OMG! What do you mean? The more I think about it, I think maybe I'm right. When I was five, there was this kid I met in the sandbox of the park by my house. She hid it with her hair, but one of the eyes was almost like coming out. Oh shit, for reals? 
When I was eight, there was this boy on the bus stop on the way to school. And this girl I saw crouched down in the corner of, at the convenience store. And there was an old man I kept seeing in a tunnel under a bridge when I was in junior high. That old man was always dragging around his guts hanging out of his stomach. It was so nasty and scary. That's hella gross. That stuff happens way more now than it used to. Like the zombie chick on the platform, etc. And the frog man in the phone booth. You never told me about the frog man. Really? There's this phone booth in front of the McDonald's on the main road, and there's this guy inside who looks kind of like a frog. He's really big, fat. Big and fat, so the phone booth is like stuffed full of this frog guy. These days I almost never see him, but once in a while, when someone tries to use the phone, the phone booth gets really weird. It's like the person goes inside and enters into the frog guy's body and looks so gross and scary. So this one time I tried opening it. Like I opened the phone booth door, I mean. And the frog guy got really surprised. He made this face like, oh, OMG, I've been found. And he left the booth looking super happy. Ah. What? Also, you were in a conversation. Why'd you just stop, okay? There's something I thought of. So you're, so you're messaging me now, that's rare. Maybe the zombie chick got like that, not because of the Frappuccino guy, but because of me. Hmm, well if that's what you think, maybe you're right. I want to know for sure, I don't know myself. But my friend might. He's got the same abilities as you. Hold up. So it's you. You said to stay away, right? From the zombie chick? What happens if I get close? Well, I can only speak from my own experience. But you'd probably make her more pissed off and violent. How come? That's just how these things work. If I ever... If I had never gone to that platform, would she still have turned out like this? They react to people who can sense them. Put really simply, you could say they are happy to be found. So it's possible, yeah. Her reaction to you may have increased her power. In that case, what about her making these people kill themselves? The zombie chick leading people to death may have something to do with your power. That's one possibility, but it's only a theory. And simply knowing the case cause of this stuff isn't going to help anyone anyways. You just need to quietly walk the hell away. That's the only choice here that makes sense. Do that and gradually the zombie chick's power will weaken. But even now, she's changed into something way worse than she was before. Yeah, it's getting really fucked up. Are, pe are more people gonna die? Well, one thing that's for sure is that this isn't getting any better. Ah! It's all my fault. There's no real evidence of that, though. It's weird I hit X and nothing's happening. Oh. If I just ran away now... I feel like I'm going to regret it forever. I don't want that. Some weird issues here. It's not... Yeah. Next Monday before the first train. Let's meet at the platform in Hinoshiro Station. I thought... Yeah, let's stay away from the platform. Everybody keeps telling me to fucking go there. Just stay in chat, you little shit. What are you singing? Get the fuck out of here. What? December 18th, 7.47 a.m. Hinoshiro Station. Why does she, she look like she has to glow from the fucking old movie Bruce Leroy? What the fuck is that movie called? Damn, I cannot think of it right now. Bruce Leroy. Is the stalker not coming? That girl's not too bad looking in the picture. Placebo picture, I mean. Who the hell is that? Slash. Oh, Slash. Slash is my alter ego. So technically, he's here with me right now. Oh, I see. Like Rena, then. 
I first met Rena in the sandbox at the park near my house when I was five. And I sort of ado adopted her. Listen up. I like how he didn't listen to the story at all. You're way stronger than I am, you little shit. So you should easily be able to hold her down and take control. You've got a really special ability. Up till now, you've sealed that ability off out of fear. I can't teach you how to take that thing down. But I can give you some solid advice. There's one thing that's more important than anything. Determination. Okay. Stop playing pocket pool or whatever the fuck she's doing. Okay, what's she doing? Okay. This is freaking me out. What the fuck is he holding? Well, good morning. What? What? That looks like she- that is her picture. Is that her picture? So, did it end well? Fuck if I know. You're the one who wrote the scenario. Oh yeah, blame me. Using a kid like that. You're the one who set her up. Almost all of the old people are dead. Now all we can do is leave it to the younger ones. Okay, we're back at the coffee house again. Goddamn smartphone. No, don't sneeze. Go away. Oh, fuck. Hey, what are we gonna do today? What were we gonna again today? What? I wish he'd fucking snap and just throw the phone down and start jumping on and break it. Ah! I'm not hitting a button. You can't make me. Ah. It's weird. I don't even have a smartphone. I don't even have a fucking cell phone. Oh, that's it? That was weird. But I guess it's to show that this is going to continue on. Placebo is over. So no war in the future. Let's see if we get two trophies or one. If we get two... We finished the game. Sure. I got Yuki. Trophy. That was it. So we didn't get all the trophies. So there's still one more chapter, it looks like. Sweet. What? That's new. So we... That just opened up. That was not there because we were we were gonna start on whiteout. Okay. This opened that up. Fucking awesome. All right. I just like looking at what's here. All right. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and end this one here, and then we will continue. And I guess we're finishing this up tonight. I'm probably gonna upload this in the morning, and then we're just gonna continue straight through. There's really no reason not to. I want to finish the story. I didn't really like the Yuki one. That was weird as fuck. But I see what they're doing. They're going to continue with another generation. Which I don't really understand how that's possible. Or why that kid's way stronger than Tokyo. Which is freaky as fuck. Because Tokyo was a monster. He was badass. But alright. Uh, may the algorithm be with you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Which will be Blackout. And will apparently be our last one. It kind of sucks, but I'm, I'm, I'm more the kind of person that don't doesn't look at ha this as ending as we get to start a new adventure. I love doing that. Plus, I'm trying to get better at ending projects, so that's why I'm working so hard on this. So thank you for pushing me to do it as well. By you being attentive and having fun and hanging out and helping me, because I would have never gotten this far, which is a damn shame. A lot of people that may get this game and never, <laughs> never get very far in it. But again, you helped me in a way there too, because people are going to probably have to come to my playthrough to figure out what to do. 
and I appreciate the hell out of that note acceptance. Thank you. I will see you in the next one. Later.